the 15 budget that uh, I proposed to the county legislature and adopted in December of last year provides the largest property tax levy reduction in 14 years. We maintain the smallest workforce in 32 years. All at the same time, we preserve those core services that all of you rely on. And thanks to our efforts to streamline county government and shrink the size, scale, and scope of government, Dutchess County taxpayers will receive, will be eligible to receive a property tax rebate check this fall. Now, at the same time, we know we can't just cut our way out of economic difficulty. We have to grow. And through strategic investments in critical areas of business attraction and infrastructure, tourism promotion, and agricultural development, we are focused on an effort to grow our economy and support private sector job growth. And we do all of this in the context of a 70-30 world. The burden of state mandates continues to pressure down on county governments across the state of New York. Despite the fact that the 2015 budget spends less than the 2014 modified budget, state mandates imposed on county government increased by $2 million. If Albany and Washington feel so strongly about their programs, Albany and Washington should stop asking local property taxpayers to pay for them and instead pay for those programs themselves.